Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. The user known as Roadblock. Hey, wasn't he a G.I. Joe character? Anyway, he asked the question, Quick Time, Real Player, or Windows Media Player? Well, my answer to that is all three. It kind of depends on what kind of media you want to access. Now, if it's just MP3s, then anyone will do just fine. Uh, now, if it's, of course, the real media format, then you kind of need the real player. Or do you? I actually use something called Real Alternative in conjunction with QuickTime Alternative. And these are packages available on the Internet that you could use so that you don't have to install the real player or the QuickTime player. You could actually play those media files through other media players like VLC or Media Player Classic, both open source projects, if I believe, on multiple platforms, well, at least VLC. So that's my suggestion. I use them all for the most part. I don't use QuickTime or Real uh, on any platform, but I do use the codex or the software that makes it so that I can actually listen to QuickTime, MOV files, and Real Media files without necessarily having to install the player. Those are my ideas. What does the chat room think? What do you guys use for media players? Windows Media Player, Real, QuickTime, VLC, QuickTime, Winamp. There's a classic. Still have Winamp installed, VLC. Variety, but it seems like VLC, FTW.